Hey, what's up guys, Sam from BSE Tech. In today's video, I will be showing you how to fix uh, the camera not working or camera is not found on your computer. So today we have uh, an HP G2 650 Pro Book. And uh, as you can see on my screen, if I try to open the camera, uh, I'll get this message, very common message. Uh, plenty of uh, reasons behind this. One of the most common reason is you are upgrading from a previous Windows version to uh, the later one. For example, if you had uh, 8.1 and then you update it to Windows 10 and all of a sudden this message just came out of nowhere. Very easy and straightforward. We'll try a couple of things and see which one works. And after that, we'll click on the search and uh, we will type camera. And when we will see camera app icon, we will click on the apps settings. And uh, once we are within the apps settings, here we can see that uh, these options are unchecked. So we will try to enable them from this area. And also we will do a reset. So just in case uh, if there is uh, any issue with the app itself or the camera software module, it can reset the app and uh, as you can see that the app is reset and if we try to open the camera app we still have no luck unfortunately no camera uh, cameras are attached so then we will move towards the next step uh, which is uh, opening your uh, device manager in the device manager section uh, the first thing you will uh, have to figure out if your camera is listed here if your camera is not listed in this list and uh, it could be a possible uh, hardware problem but uh, don't worry if you know that your camera was working recently and it has stopped and we will move towards the next step but in uh, this page you can click on scan for hardware changes and uh, if that does not appear then you can click on view and here we have this uh, show hidden devices and there you go guys the hp hd camera is there and now we will be clicking on the update driver and we will wait for uh, this uh, utility page to search for uh, drivers online and then they can automatically update if there is any pending update for uh, the camera driver so guys remember view and then show hidden devices and that will basically show the camera in this setting so depending on your internet speed as you can see that uh, window has determined that the best driver for the device is already installed we will close this and uh, we will click on the camera and uh, unfortunately the same problem same error code no cameras are attached now we will uh, click on the search bar again and we will right click on the camera and in the apps settings hopefully this will fix but uh, we'll give it a go we will come back to this page and then we will do it another reset and see if this is going to fix the camera also we will uh, try to see if there is any pending update system updates that can also play a major part especially for uh, your camera module so you can see that device is missing important uh, security and bug fixes so we will not go for that option we will simply restart the system because we have just done uh, performed a reset on the app itself and also we have uh, uh, applied the scan for hardware changes on the system utility in device manager so we will wait for the machine to completely boot up and uh, we will try to turn on the camera and see if this works if it does not work then i will take you towards the next step so keep watching and don't miss that last step hopefully we'll be able to fix the camera and let's open the camera app from uh, the menu and uh, we still have this problem okay so let's check this in the device manager if the camera is listed there we have done a couple of uh, bits and pieces and uh, we were unable to fix the camera so far by performing these actions 
uh, camera is again missing as you can see if we click on view and if we click on show hidden devices the camera comes back again so guys there is something to do with the bios settings which i understand uh, can be easy fix for your camera so what i'm going to do is after this update driver page i will be booting towards uh, the, the bios utility page and hopefully i'll uh, find it there if no then i will tell you what else we can do so the camera is there hp hd camera which means the camera is installed so now i'm going to shut down the machine and we'll reboot into the bios page so i think here we are on uh, the startup menu and uh, we can go into the bios setup and you have to look for uh, devices or uh, internal devices or uh, camera in these settings so take your time as you can see we have in these four tabs in this hp uh, utility page boot option secure boot option system options built-in devices option possibly this can be the reason so here we have wireless integrated microphone headphones wireless uh, utility and uh, if we keep going down here we have uh, two more integrated devices the first one is integrated camera seems like unchecked second one is fingerprint device so i will check that as well so the both are working fine as you can see in the system utility setup so this option it was unchecked which i just checked now and i'm going to do is i'm going to save this page and then i will click on yes and then i will exit this page and i will reboot the system and we'll see if we can fix this problem so system is back up and running i'm going to uh, launch the camera from the settings but before that i will uh, uh, allow the device manager utility page to change uh, scan for the hardware changes just to make sure that uh, we are uh, uh, we are following the right procedure so i will launch uh, device manager and in device manager i just want to make sure that the camera is still there if camera is not there so guys the camera is there uh, we click on the system icon with the device name and scan for hardware changes so the camera is there now it's not missing after the reboot so let's open uh, the camera app and see if it works so the camera is not attached uh, it's the same problem again the camera is uh, not attached we will click on device manager i think here we have uh, missed something enable device so this is the problem guys i think the device was uh, uh not functioning properly even though i have updated from the bios settings so i will try to open the camera again and here you go guys that the light has come back as you can see and we have finally managed to bring it back to life and the camera is now absolutely fine so remember guys there are a couple of steps which uh, you might uh, have to take in order to make your camera work again so you can also use a hdr and hdr auto and then the settings page is still there you can pick and choose these options so that's it for today's video guys if this video has helped you out in any way please subscribe to my channel and also leave your comments in the comment section below see you soon with another video till then take care bye bye